happy Sunday. Let's go shopping. I'm going to Home Sense, Home Goods, and West Elm, and I'm gonna take you guys with me to see what's in the stores and to see if I'm gonna buy anything. I'm looking for mainly pillow, pillows, pillars for my client because I'm almost finished. Can't wait to show you guys that finished product. So yeah, see you guys at the store. Bye. Okay, guys. So I'm in Home Sense, and um, I'm just honestly looking for some unique accessories. Huh. This is something. This is not bad, you know. Not, not that. This one. This is thirty dollars. That's not bad. And I have two. It's kind of same same price at Target, you know. That's not bad. I don't want this. I don't know why I'm drawn to like these tulips, like in a bathroom, you know, like a guest bathroom where you don't go all the time. It'd be nice. Thinking about that for my client, but that might be too big. These are pretty. This is nice. Oh, it's $30. Though. Oh, gosh. I'm to find something unique and different in all this that they have. These are so overplayed now. So overdone. And that's the thing sometimes with home decor. It's become so trendy that it just loses some of its uniqueness to it. This box is pretty. How much is it though? Maybe like $60. Oh, 30. It's different. I like that. Dang, this, no offense, but this looks like a casket. I, I don't want that. Let's see what they have from a pillar standpoint. Okay, so um, I like this one. I like the texture of it. I like the size of it. I really do like it. But I also... I also have this one that I like too. It has the... um. It has the little gold zipper right here, which is, which is different. And um, I was thinking about, I have those dark blue, those dark blue um, artwork. This is, this is different. I don't know which one it is. I don't know which, oh my goodness. Look at this. It's the, it's the, it's the details for me. Yeah. It's the details. Yeah. See? It's the little things. So I I um I would do this and then I bought some pillars from from our house that has some blue in it too. That's gonna be pretty with this. I'm so excited. And I would love to find like some unique shape, either like a circle one or a lumbar one to go with it. Okay, let's keep going. Listen, people are watching me. I don't care. Oh, I need pillars for the sitting area. I wanted something like this, but not this, but like this size, this, I need four of these to go in the sitting area, but we're going to go to West End, so I might get lucky. It's pretty. Listen, you can't be, I used to be very fearful of recording in public. Mm-mm, honey, I'm a... 
I, I think this depends on where you're going away. All right, guys. Um, on my way to West Ham. See what they have. Thank you. Hi. As I'm walking through the store, I just noticed that there's a lot of blues, different shades of blues. And it's, it's refreshing to see that color right now. It's very cool. I think it's very reminiscent of summertime, like water and stuff like that. So I'm enjoying it. This pillow is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. But I'm going to head on over to the clearance section and show you guys what I see over there. It was not a lot of stuff that I'm looking for. But when it comes to outdoor rugs, that was a main, that was a main thing that was in that section. But West Elm is, for me, it's very trendy. But I just try to find unique pieces within the store to accessorize my right projects here. we want to look for something specific so back here we have a lot of runners a lot of runners i always come to the clearance section first these are nice but i don't know what i want to get sorry um, What is this? Hmm. Is it a lot? Oh, it's a planter. Don't wonder. So, nothing back here really. So, oh. <laughs> nice moves. So, we have a kind of a cell section here. And um, these are pretty. Oh, these are these are nice, like candle holders. How much are these? Nineteen dollars. Napkin rings. Thirty. This is pretty. Oh, this is pretty. For hosting, this is pretty. Okay. Um, they got some pillow covers down here. So let me see. I'm gonna look through and see what I can find. Hold on. Okay, guys. So I left West M. Nothing. And the vibe was given very much. Um, Philip blankets. It wasn't comfortable. Let's just say that. No one greeted me. No one said anything. And I'm pretty sure maybe it's maybe because it's Sunday and the area that I'm in is very much a highly brunch area so maybe that's the reason why but i just feel like regardless of how busy it is you still need to address your customer so i left went back to my car i don't have time to go to tj maxx but i did get some stuff from home sense so i will show you those things but i'm going to swing by h and because on the way back to the garage Hey guys, so here's a chandelier purchase, but I effed up. It was too big to come through the front door. It is stunning, and we just had to figure it out. This took us hours to figure out. In the next slide, you're gonna see how we got this in. We had to take out an entire glass door and everything to get it in, and it's gonna take maybe four to six men to get it inside the house. It was it was so so bad it was so so bad i was panicking and everything but thank goodness thank goodness for alex and these guys who got it in um do not underestimate the size of these rh chandelier this was a 48 inch chandelier we wanted a 60 so thank goodness we didn't get 60 but it was a beast to get in but again love it so lesson learned measure your doorway before you order anything from restoration hardware 
look at this truly truly stunning but again it ended great we put the door back in you couldn't even tell nothing was missing but this was the ugly stage of it here it goes and the guys hung each crystal hand by hand and the chandelier weighed over 500 pounds no almost 500 pounds and here come alex right here thank you sir thank you thank you so so much but yeah the project is coming along great I can't wait to show you guys how everything looks. Thank you all so much for your patience. Hope you guys are enjoying the sneak peek I've given you, I've shown you behind the scene of this amazing, amazing opportunity that I've been blessed to be a part of. And it wouldn't have been possible by myself. So if Alex is watching, thank you, Alex. Thank you guys so much for always supporting me. Never stop chasing your dreams. Here are the guys putting back in the doors again. But it's been truly, truly, truly amazing time getting these things get this chandelier up and it's, it's a beast but um thank y'all so much don't forget to comment and subscribe to see how this journey is going here's the beauty right here so so beautiful enjoy the rest of your day be blessed be blessed bye sometimes when i'm thinking about us before we got lost and we parted Back to back we would carry on then We'd do anything for what we started But this time we could